A lot of people, including me, are waiting for the blue stack versions that support directly to the M1 architectures. But in the meantime, there is no version available yet. So I did some research and found that Google has released the Android emulator versions, but only preview versions. So that is kind of interesting news, especially for those of you who are asking me to make a videos on how to install the Android emulators on these computers. So I don't waste more time, let's dive right into it. So first step, I will need you to follow the link in the description to download the latest versions of Android Studio Preview to your computers. And now, once you've done this, just double click to decompress the file and start to install just need to follow me step by step once you're done with that just double click to the android studio preview and open now you see on the top right corner select avd manager because I already create one device over here, so it, it lists here, you can see your virtual device. So you can create many virtual device as you wish. And if you are new, you will need to click to create virtual device. And we have a different categories over here. We have a TV, phone, VOS, tablet, and automotive so with tv we have a uh, android tv with different uh resolution phone we have more same with tablets and wear os so i will try with the phone models let's see the uh, pixel 3 click on next uh, because this one i download already so i don't need to download again so if if you are new you will need to click to download and wait a little bit to complete once you finish you can click next and just a final step before you can launch your virtual device you can edit the av name like your name for later use and you can select their startup orientations can be portraits or landscape and select finish to add it here so now your virtual device have a two different device one is pixel 3a and one is pixel 3 so under action you can see the play button just click on that to launch the device okay now it's on so you can see it is like a normal android um, screen and let's see what we have here on the right side we got some navigate button and we got more over here and you can drag from the top yes you can drag from the top you can drag from the top for the notification board with few settings over here and as usual from the bottom you can have the menu applications so basically we got everything that a normal android phone has exclude the functions to call messages and taking pictures because it is not a real one so you can get a sim card or a camera yep so i read some forum and they said uh every time they use this virtual device and go to chrome they uh they got crashed so today I'm gonna try and see if that will happen and test it performing why open uh chrome and uh, I will open 
using Chrome to open YouTube and reading news or something. Okay, let's try YouTube first. Okay, it's lagging. Even it's not a crash, but uh, it's very lag. I can experience some delay when I scrolling down. Let's click to one videos. You can see the flash. Yeah. So it's very delayed and slow. All right, let's get rid of that. And some people said that I can't play game on this too. So why don't we try some of the basic game um, and see how it's perform. So I'm gonna sign on it. Okay, so uh, I will try one simple game that you definitely tried before. It is it's called Ninja Fruit. Nin yeah, Fruit Ninja. Download five thousand. Download. Okay, open it. Okay, respond pretty quick. And you can drag to have bigger screen. Who doesn't like bigger screen, huh? Oh, a little bit of delight. I don't think this game is require much um, graphic quality. So it's not really good ideas if you use this for playing game. I think this version is only for work or playing very simple game. Okay, it's very slow and delight. Even we're not in the game yet, it's just a uh, review or advertise for head. 2000 years later. This crush. I mean, people from internet. Who tell me to play on this device maybe they mean it's very light and basic game because you know like this game doesn't work so anyway uh, you don't download this for playing game most of people will try this to uh, lie with uh, their work to testing um, so it's a preview versions it is not perfect yet but at least you, know, you got something to to work on it and um, uh, you got it like a tune to test your uh, Android applications right on your M1 MacBook you don't need to buy another one or simply for uh, I don't know for entertaining purpose so that is all for today. Thanks for watching. If you like other videos, feel free to check out my channel and do subscribe to it. If you have any ideas, uh, you want me to do any tutorial, just leave a comment below and I will definitely do that. Thanks for watching and see you guys in the next video.